My favorite performing moment was with the LXD. We did TED Talks. All of the great thinkers of the world come together at a conference and it's scientists and um, designers and artists and the geniuses of the world in all aspects. Being in a room for these great minds that have such an impact on the world and knowing that we were there to show dance just for the sake of showing dance was incredible. This was also at the time when the Winter Olympics were happening, and I've always wished that dancers had something that were like our Olympics, or our Oscars, or our Grammys, or, you know, we don't have what actors and athletes and musicians have, those big moments where it's like, I want to win a Grammy. Those big moments that you train for, and it's do or die, and you know. That was like the closest I felt to feeling like we had our Olympics. Like Flips would be doing his head spins and we'd all be like, come on Flips, come on Flips, come on you got it. And then he'd, do, he'd hit it perfectly and end on the accent. We're like, yes, good job. And it's like the trickers are about to go out and they're like, all right, let's go get this. And they're like high-fiving each other and they're like, Whew, and they're in the wings and then they go out and they do their thing and we're watching on the monitor and we're like, yes, they hit it, they hit it. And then it's the girl's turn and I'm like, okay, Shelby, here we go. We go and then it's like, I love you, I love you. And then we go out and we do our section and then it's like, I felt that rush that was, that I've never felt before. While I was on stage, I'm like, remember this, remember this moment. I walked out and I heard the cameras clicking and stuff and I'm like, they're taking pictures of me showing what I'm doing as a dancer. They're not taking pictures of me behind a, an artist or in my Nike gear for a Nike industrial. They're taking pictures of LXD, which is representing dance. And I was just like, remember this, remember this moment and remember who's in the audience and take it all in. Bill Gates was there and he tweeted about us afterwards. <laughs> By the time we got down to the dressing room, he had tweeted about us. And then at the very end of the routine, Shelby, who's one of the other dancers, she's, we were in the wings about to go out for a bow and she's, she goes, look at their faces in the audience. And I look out and there were people crying and there were people that were smiling like, like when you see a baby and you're just, it's just the most genuine like, oh, that smile of being content and when I saw those faces I just like it just hit me and so I walked out and we all stood in our line to take our bow and everybody stood up in the audience and it was the longest standing ovation at TED history mind you people go up there and talk about how they're saving the world and they stood up and they gave us a standing ovation and I just started crying I was crying and I couldn't stop and they just like it just kept coming they just they just kept clapping for us and it was just the combination of the people that I love, doing what I love, and them being touched by it, you know? You don't touch people like that all the time. It just made me really proud to be a dancer. And we haven't had moments like that. Dancers are rarely, um, we don't, we're rarely proud of what we do. And I wish people were more proud. And Elksy has made me proud to be a dancer. <laughs>